Dear friends in Jesus Christ, the Gospel of today, Matthew chapter 3 verses 13 to 17 speaks about new life, new relationship and new ministry. As Jesus receives baptism from John the Baptist, God the Father affirms his only son in his salvific ministry by saying, You are my beloved son with whom I am well pleased whereby Jesus enters into new life of his public ministry and makes new relationship with the humanity. When we receive baptism, we also enter into River Jordan along with Jesus Christ who gives us new life, new life primarily personal and public identification. Through this identification, we enter into new relationship with God and people and makes us his own by giving us new responsibility to become his witnesses. The baptism of the Lord teaches us four lessons. The first, to be humble. The baptism of the Lord reveals his humility by submitting himself humbly to the baptism given by John the Baptist. And the second point, identifying oneself with the poor. Jesus identifies himself with us who are merely a sinner, marginalized and oppressed. And the third point, the importance of the Holy Spirit. As Jesus immersed in the water, the Holy Spirit gave him power to proclaim good news to the poor, to proclaim release to the captives and let the oppressed go free. And the fourth point, Jesus surrenders himself totally to the will of his Father. Ever since Jesus inaugurated his mission through the baptism, he surrenders himself totally to the will of his Father through which Jesus set an example for all of us. We thank God for the gift of our own baptism, through which we share in his divine mission. And we ask pardon for the time when we were unaware of the mission entrusted to us by the Father. And we ask for the grace to begin a new life and to remain humble and obedient to the will of God and be faithful to the baptismal promises. Amen.